This is Officer Bodie with the Deer Park Police Department. We'd like to provide you with some tips to reduce accidents along Center Street. Okay, so let's start with median safety. As you can see in this photo, this silver truck has managed to stop with the back of the vehicle in the moving lane of traffic. That truck there that had to stop, had to stop from 40 miles per hour in order to avoid running into the back of the silver truck. In this second shot, you'll see that the silver truck has managed to pull up far enough to allow traffic to pass both in front and behind the vehicle without causing other vehicles to slow. In this third shot, you'll see where the silver truck has passed the tan car. Both of them have managed to get out of the moving lanes of traffic into the median, and this allows both vehicles to see around each other. If they were to switch their positions, they wouldn't be able to see around each other. Also, notice the third vehicle involved in this shot is the actual white SUV with its yellow signal on. That vehicle should not stop in the 40 mile per hour moving lane of traffic. They should continue onward to the next median to where they can actually exit their moving lane of traffic safely. In this next shot, the silver truck has safely entered the median. The problem here is going to be that the silver truck will continue the wrong way into oncoming traffic to enter the private drive. What the silver truck should have done here was continue down Center Street to the next crossover median and safely U-turned and come back to the private drive. In this next shot, you'll see the silver truck has managed to stop in the moving lane of traffic. Look at the back of the truck. It's completely blocking the inside lane. Look at the front of the truck now. The truck should have pulled all the way forward to the white stop line. Make sure that if your vehicle is too big to fit into the center median, that you go down to a median where you can get out of the moving lane of traffic. Remember, we want to share the road for the safety of all the other drivers. If you have any other questions, feel free to contact the Deer Park Police Department.